What's up guys, it's Flood Slayer here showing you the uh, all new Covenant Banshee. It's not that new, it was made in 2011 I'm pretty sure. So it comes with the Covenant Banshee and it comes with the Elite Flight with a pistol. Um, I'm just going to show you the instruction manual first. You can see you got the Banshee at the very back, you got the Elite Flight. Overall there's only 12 steps, so it's really fast, I'm sure enough. 13 steps, you can the stigma. Um, um, set nine six eight five nine. Uh, yeah, let's get down to business. So as you can see, first we have our red flight elite. Let me just get rid of the plasma pistol first. So yeah, we got the we got the red flight elite. He's got the blue thing on the top. Um, oh, his hand is gone on the plasma pistol. I'm sorry. Let me just put this back in a sec. Showing you the banshee. Oh. So this is actually different than the Hero Heroes Pack, I believe it's called Series Five Heroes Pack. I'm pretty sure, pretty sure it's Series Three. Um, as you can see, there's no peg hole. Um, like I said, the only difference is that he really has a thing on on his top of his head, and he has elite pilot body. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Next up is the whoops. Next up is the weapons. It's a purple plasma pistol. It's very nice. Um, it's got no collar on it though, so it's, I don't know, alright. Next up is the Banshee, um, it actually doesn't come with these bullet holes, it actually, the bullet holes actually came with extra stickers in my Covenant Phantom set. If you want to see the newly updated one, click right there, it's a newly updated video. Or if you want to see my all new ODST Ambush set review, right there. Alright guys, these are all new reviews. Um, updated ones of my old ones because they all suck. But yeah, as you can see, I put bullet holes on it. Let's get on to the inside. Actually, no, before I do that, it has the booster power things, I think they're called. Those blue things on the top are the um, plasma lights or whatever. Not plasma lights, but they're lights. Um, and then we got uh, what are things here? two plasma repeaters. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's get on to the inside. Um, as you can see, it's got my uh, white flight elite from my Phantom set. Sorry, yet to see that. I never even realized that. As you can see, we got the screen right here. Um, warning, this is my opinion. Um, I think the only way for the Banshee to see is if it is for the pilot to see is if he looks into this um, oops, see two piece, and then there's obviously like some kind of like a camera here that he can see through. Um, yeah, this piece right here it likes to fall off a lot, so sorry about. That. You can see he's got the two handles and then his legs go right in that little slot right there. I'll even show you in a second. Show you the little instruction manual. Right. So as you can see, you know, you got the Elite in the picture. And then, you know, you got the Banshee overhead. I'm not really sure why the Banshee is inside it, though. Or sorry, why the guy's outside of the Banshee. I mean, there's no one actually driving the Banshee. As you can see, the Elite Pilot's was driving it, but for some reason the Banshee's driving itself. Don't know, really know how that works out. Okay. Well, anyway, look inside it. You can see that his leg is going that little slot right there. His arms were there, and his head actually isn't looking at the screen for some reason. It's just looking at blankly nothing. And another thing I don't really like about the set is that you can actually see the guy. And in most of the Halo games, you actually couldn't see the guy. And also there's these little clear pieces there for no apparent reason at all. I don't even know why they put it in. But anyway guys, um, thanks for watching. This was the uh, Covenant Banshee set. Um, it was about $15 for me, but in case you guys haven't seen any of my other videos, I talked a bit about this. Um, a store kind of like Target that's going down, Target or Walmart. Um, my version of that store is called uh, Walmart. Or sorry, it's called uh, Zeller's. I have a Walmart nearby, but I don't really ever buy from that because it's kind of far away. But, um, and my Zellers is actually being bought out by Target, so they went on like super sale. This was actually 95% off or something crazy. No, 90% off. So it went from $15 to $5. So basically, this set was $5, but ODST Ambush was $5. And I got two Phantom sets. Um, this Phantom set was about $40. So altogether, I spent about $100. But anyway guys, um, thanks for watching. This was the uh, Covenant Banshee set. Oh, um, I think my Banshee has something to say to you. Oh, no he doesn't? Okay. I guess he doesn't. Um, thanks for watching guys. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, like.
like, honestly. Please comment. Just comment. Just click on this little bar and just type in something. Type in random words if you have to. I just want to, I don't know. I just want to talk to you. If you guys want to see my awesome friend named Cuckoo Muncher, his channel, the link to his channel will be right there. He's an awesome guy. He's awesome Lego. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'd really appreciate it if you would leave a like, comment, rate, rate or subscribe. Subscribe would be awesome. Remember, guys, if I get five subscribers, I might do some, uh, reviews on my Lego brick arms here. I've got way more than this, but way more. Probably got five times that. Um, uh, yeah, Blood Slayer signing off. Peace.